check this memory stick out. If James Bond was to have a memory stick, this would be the one. It even has a self-destruct feature, which we're going to set off. Hello, I'm Damon from Mercia Solutions. We've been integrating the Datashore Pro into our forensic storage system. These are really well built. Slightly larger than a regular thumb drive, but that's not surprising, as it contains a keypad, hardware encryption, and even a rechargeable battery, which charges from the USB port. So, looking at the hardware, we can see that it actually comes with this nice aluminium sleeve, and the rubber seal on here gives it an IP68 rating, which means it can survive being submerged underwater for 30 minutes, up to 1.5 meters. Therefore, if you're unlucky enough to get it wet or even drop it down a lavatory, you should be fine to wash it off and carry on using it. Let's take a look at how this works. Quite simply, we unlock the device, enter a pin code, and when the green light is lit, we can connect it to a computer. On the computer, we can drag files onto the memory stick, and this could be on a PC, Mac, or even a Linux machine. As you can see on the computer, it's popped up, Datashore Pro 2. And on here, I've got a folder I can delete. And just like a normal memory stick, I can drag files back onto here, just as a regular drive. And it's used as simply as you would any other thumb drive. Let me eject it. When you eject the drive, it automatically locks, securing your data again. The memory stick uses a pin code to identify the user or function, such as self-destruct. We've just used the admin pin. I've set up two more pins. One, a user account, which I've set to be read-only, and then also the self-destruct pin. Let's log in as the user account. Okay, so we've just connected back to the computer. You can see we've got the memory stick. This is now as the user. If I'm trying to delete something, you can see everything is read-only. So we don't have any access to do anything further with it. If I launch disk management, we can see the device is actually read-only. One of my favorite things with this memory stick is that it has a serial number, which can be used for audit trail and whitelisting access on computers, which is very useful for controlling access to data and enabling people to plug this into a machine and use it. Or B, recording who has taken data where. Okay, moment we've all been waiting for. Let's enter the self-destruct code and plug it back in. Okay, self-destruct code's entered. Got some flashing lights. And the green light, we will reconnect this to the computer and we'll see what we get. So as you can see now, this has appeared as USB drive I. And if I try to access it, it says you need to format it. Again, let's have a look at uh, the disk management. You can see here in the disk management, it's come up as a raw device. Now, we can recover this, not the data, but we can actually reset the device up, reconfigure some new pins and carry on and actually use the device again. It doesn't actually break the device, it just destroys all of the data that's contained on there and all of the pin codes. Thank you, I hope you found this useful. Please consider liking and subscribing to the channel if you'd like to see other products like this. Thank you.